Do you want to improve your workflow in Logic Pro X, the free project template? If so, keep watching this video and get the download link in the description below. Looking at a blank project screen when you're just getting started with a song can be daunting, especially when you know how much work there still is to do to get it to the place where you want it to be, where you feel comfortable releasing it. Project templates were game-changing for my workflow in helping me make music faster, more consistently, and better mixed. Instead of setting up a project from scratch each time, now I start my projects from a template that has all my tracks, plugins, routing, set up just the way I want it. All I need to do is change those along the way and turn some knobs to continue to mix it and customize it for that song. So here's how you get set up with your free template and get it installed into your Logic instance. First step is to go get that free download in the link in the description below or just go to freetemplate.cradlecat.com. The next steps are just how to get that file into your Logic instance. So in your downloads folder, Go ahead and look at that zip file that we just downloaded and double click it to unzip it. And now we have the actual logic file that we need. So go ahead and copy that or just leave the window open. So I just command C copied it. And then let's go ahead over to the um, uh, new finder window, go to your Macintosh HD or your main hard drive, and then go to users, your username, go to music, audio music apps, and then go to project templates. And here, you'll just paste that in or drag it on over. And I already had it in here, but you'll drag in that Cradle Cat template into your project templates. Great, so to actually use that template that we just downloaded on your new projects, go ahead and open up Logic Pro, go to file, and then instead of just new, go to new from template. And here, uh, go to My Templates, and you'll see that Cradle Cat template available. So go ahead and click on that, click Choose, and that will load up our project using that new template that we just downloaded. Great, so now you're up and running with that new template, being able to create projects from it instead of just starting from scratch. If you want any more details on how to use it, go ahead and check out this next video. Otherwise, feel free to go ahead and just start playing around with it on your own. I hope this template helps you create music more quickly, more efficiently, and even sounding better. If you found it helpful, go ahead and subscribe to my YouTube channel here. I'm Marcus of Cradle Cat. I post my own music and tutorials like this or other behind the scenes videos of the production side of things. Also, if you know of a friend that you think would find this video or this template helpful, go ahead and share this video with them too. Thanks, and I'll see you next time.